Good morning. It is day two. We stopped last night at the Jenny Knob Shelter and had a pretty good night. It rained off and on through the night. It's supposed to rain off and on all day today. I'm going down to get some more water <clears throat> before we leave out. We did 12, right at 12 miles yesterday. Not sure what we're going to do today. I tell you though, I'm using some new shoes. These are some Ultra Mid-Rise 4.0, I think. And um, I went to them because my other the other shoes that I wear, boots or Solomons, and they're waterproof. And they're really warm, and they're really great for the cooler months. But I was wanting something that, and they started to leak. They aren't waterproof anymore. <clears throat> so, I thought I'd get something that wasn't waterproof and see how that worked. The only thing I could find that had a ankle support was these ultras, mids. Um, but oh my goodness, by the end of the day yesterday, my ankles were killing me. I thought, I mean, they felt like they were broken. I don't know what today's going to hold. I hope they don't do that again. I, it's probably just because it doesn't have as much support as the Solomons. I'm guessing. Um, and get water there. Anyway, they were hurting pretty bad every time we stopped. They felt fine once I got the pack off and everything. Watch me get water. Since it's supposed to rain off and on today, I think I'll go ahead and get my water for the day. I'll leave most of it. I don't have to stop much. Let's see. Let's see. <sighs> Well, that should be good. Oh, how am I going with that? Hang on, let me put you down for a second. Alright. I'm sure I'm looking pretty this morning. I haven't even looked at myself. Anyway, I think the plan is around 10 or 11 miles. I'm not for sure. Or 15 to the shelter. I think it's 15. Be nice to be in a shelter again because of the rain. Let's see. All right, we'll be getting started here before long. As soon as I filter this water, we'll be heading out. I slept fairly well. Stayed plenty warm. And of course, nobody else showed up to stay. So we had the shelter to ourselves, which was nice. All right, let me get this turned off so I can get on up this hill. It's 8.30, we're about 30 minutes in. Yeah, we left at eight this morning. I just wanted to show you this water because it's awesome to be able to walk but the trail runs right next to a babbling brook stream creek whatever you want to call it it's just I guess the sounds of it are just comforting and so when you're walking next to it it just seems so heavenly I guess I don't know another term for it Anyway. I'm supposed to have off and on showers through the day. I'm hoping they're off more than that than they're on. Look at this. It's just so lush and pretty. I just love it. This is where I, whenever, if I ever get to move 
up into the mountains. I hope my house is near a stream so that I can um, sit on my porch and hear it. I don't want to be too close to it because I would hate for it to rise and tear my house down. But I'd like to be where I could hear it. And if I wanted to, I could carry a chair down and just sit by the, by the stream and listen to it. It's just so cleansing, it seems like to me. Cleanses the mind. I'm not sure, four to, between four and five. It's 10 o'clock, so we've been out walking two hours. It's been a <clears throat> fairly nice walk this morning. Uh, we did have one fairly good up, but it wasn't too bad. And now we've just been kind of meandering on a ridge and now down, we've come down and now we're just easing across. Been a pleasant walk so far today. Hope the rest of the day is this easy and pleasant. Probably we can, might can make it to that shelter, but that's going to be 15 miles. The only reason we definitely want to go there would be for any rain over the night. But I don't, I don't think it's supposed to be thunderstorms or anything. It's just it said drizzle, light rain all day. So it may not be bad. We'll see. It's funny how you can be walking through all these hard woods and Everything feels so rainforesty, and suddenly you round a corner, and suddenly everything just changes. Like now it's this grassy meadow. It's neat. Keeps it interesting. But then again, I worry about ticks or um, red bugs hanging in these grass. Guess I should have sprayed my legs. Find time to think about it. There's our Stacy. <laughs> We're not far from a road crossing. We're going to stop somewhere close to that and take a break. Probably get some lunch since it's almost uh, almost 12, I think. This is cool. Except for wondering if I'm going to have red bugs. Oof.
cool bridge. Nice campsite off to the left. It moves. Yeah, I don't want to ford that river for sure. Let's see, that's the road, so we probably want to take a break right somewhere back here. This is Dismal Falls. Looks like it's going to turn into a 15 mile day so we can get to that Wapiti shelter and get out of the rain. A lot of the trail is turning into a stream. So my feet are sopping wet. Nothing I can do about it. I'll just go on. My knee has been kind of acting up. I've had it do this before. The only thing that relieved it was a knee brace, but we're going to see. I'm going to stretch it out really good. It's that left side. I think it's that IT band is pulling. I'm going to try to do a good job of stretching it. I ran into a dumb tree. It's hanging over the trail. 
I didn't see it because I had my ball cap on. Ouch. <sighs> my ankle hurts, by the way. Anyway, I have a ball cap on. And I was watching where I was walking. I didn't even see it. I guess the bill of my cap got in the way. Ran smooth into it. Conked my head. Somehow bent my fingernail back and my thumbnail backwards. And stumped my left big toe all at the same time. And my teeth slammed together at the same time. I don't know. It was really freaky. It hurt. I probably got a lump on my head. But I'm not going to stop and check it now. I'll just be thankful to get to our resting point. Get out of these wet shoes. Ooh. Alright. I don't know how much farther we've got. At least two miles. There's supposed to be a campsite. We should be getting close. And then from there, it will be another two miles to the shelter. Alright. See you later. Interesting cute pond. Which I don't recall seeing on Gut Hook or on the AWOL's guide. Well, I hope we're not far. It has been so wet. Streams are out of their banks, covering the trail. Mercy. Sick of the rain.